morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, sir. Welcome to the Daily Grind. How you doing out there this morning? Good, I hope. I hope you're having a great morning. hope you have a great day today. If you're up here in Maine, it's pretty nasty out there. Roads are icy. It's slippery. Be careful out there if you got to go out. If you don't got to go out, don't. Chill out. Relax. All right, let's get crack lacking, chummy. Don't take on what's not yours. That's the topic today. Don't take on what's not yours. Don't take on other people's pain, other people's sadness, other people's problems, other people's bull crap. Don't take it on. If it's not yours, you don't have to take it on. Now, you know, if you know somebody that's hurting and they're in pain or, you know, whether it's physical or emotional or something like that, pray for them. It's okay to pray for them. It's okay to ask other people to pray for them. It's okay to help them if you can. But don't take on what's not yours. If it's not yours, don't take it on. Do what you can to help them out and then get on with your life. You got your own stuff to deal with, your own stuff going on. Uh, and and uh, you don't need to be taking on other people's. Also, don't take on shame or guilt or resentment or remorse or things like that. Don't pick them up if they're not yours. You don't need to pick up what isn't yours. You don't need to take on what isn't yours. Um I know people that do that. You, I'll hear them talking about, oh, my friend this and my other friend that, and my friend this, and they got all this stuff going on, and oh, my God, it's so terrible, and, and you'd think it was going on with them. They've taken it all on. It's not yours to take on. It's not your cross to bear. You don't have to take that on. It's okay to get out there and live your life, even though some of your friends are not maybe doing so good. Uh, you still get to live your life and enjoy it. You don't have to take on their stuff. You get enough of your own. Like I said, do what you can to help them out. If you can, that's, you know, by all means, help them out. Pray for them. Do what you can. But don't take on what isn't yours. Uh, somebody else is doing something. Somebody else's opinion. Or any of that stuff. It's not yours. Don't take it on. What somebody else does is not yours to take on. It doesn't have anything to do with you. It has everything to do with them. Uh, let them have it. Let them, it's theirs. Let them deal with it. I know sometimes that can be hard. You want to fix people. You want to help people. You want to do whatever you can. But uh, you can only do what you can only do. And that's it. You can't do it for them. You can't take their emotional or physical pain for them. They've got to, they've got to take that. They've got to deal with it. They've got to do what they can. Uh, it's not it's not yours don't take it on and the other aspect that i talk about emotions that don't belong to you things that um you know guilt shame negative self-thinking all that stuff don't pick that up it doesn't belong to you don't pick it up a lot of that stuff is pre-programmed into you as a child somebody might have said you know you shouldn't do that you're bad or whatever about things and and all of a sudden you took on guilt and shame and it became an automatic response. Uh, you're an adult now. It's time to process that and move away from that kind of thinking. You don't have to take on guilt and shame every time something may not seem quite right. You know, that's life. Life happens and things go on. And the best thing to do is learn from all of that stuff and just not take on that stuff that we beat ourselves up with. You know, you did something that weren't quite right maybe and you start to feel guilty or shameful or something. Uh, is there any growth in that? Let me ask you, I don't think so. There's no growth in shame. There's no growth in guilt. There's no growth in self-abuse any way, shape, or form. So don't take it on. Learn from it and say, okay, I'll do better next time. Uh, and that's and that's the best thing you can do is learn from it and do better next time and move on. Just move right on. Carrying shame or guilt or, or negative thoughts around from something that happened to you years ago, what good does that do you? None doesn't do you one bit of good so let it go move on get into the swing of life today and and get happy so that's my story i'm sticking to it don't take on what's not yours and uh, get out there and have the best day you can have i hope you have a great day today and uh, i'll see you tomorrow